Welcome to the latest update on the water levels at Lake Mead. In a positive turn of events, the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation has announced that the increased releases from Lake Powell will continue until the end of May, further boosting the water levels. As the water is released from Lake Powell through the Glen Canyon Dam, it flows south along the majestic Colorado River, passing through the Grand Canyon and eventually reaching Lake Mead. This year, the Colorado Rockies experienced record snowfall, contributing to the majority of the water in the Colorado River Basin. In May, the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation plans to release nearly twice as much water compared to previous months. The release volume from Glen Canyon Dam will vary, ranging from approximately 14,051 cubic feet per second during early morning hours to a high of 18,909 cubic feet per second in the afternoons and evenings. Just a few weeks ago, a high flow experiment took place, where the release flow from Glen Canyon Dam surged to almost 40,000 cubic feet per second. This experiment not only aimed to restore sand banks in the Grand Canyon, but also played a significant role in raising Lake Mead's water levels by over two feet in just one week. The recent rise in water levels at Lake Mead brings much needed relief and hope to the millions of people, farms, and industries that rely on it for their daily water supply. As the largest reservoir in the United States, Lake Mead's water levels have been a concern for quite some time. After years of drought and severe water loss, the almost four-foot increase in water levels at Lake Mead in April marked an excellent start to the year, bringing the lake closer to where it was a year ago. Last year's water loss was severe, raising questions about the ongoing water drought in Las Vegas and making international headlines. The increase in water levels is primarily attributed to the persistent snowmelt in the Colorado Rockies, which serves as the primary source of water for the Colorado River Basin. Additionally, the high flow experiment conducted by the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation in April played a crucial role in restoring sandbanks in the Grand Canyon and further raising Lake Mead's water levels. The positive trend is expected to continue as the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation plans to closely monitor the inflow into Lake Powell and adjust the release volume from Glen Canyon Dam accordingly. The current rise in water levels at Lake Mead provides hope that the worst-case scenario may be behind us, offering some respite from the long-lasting drought in the southwest region. With each passing month, the water levels at Lake Mead show signs of improvement. While challenges remain, the recent increase in water releases and the dedication of organizations like the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation provide optimism for the future of this vital water resource. Thank you for watching.